Do you have something to read us? I do. I want to give you a sense of Give of me a sense of it, yeah. And yeah. this is a, a section. Now, this is a novel. This it, is not no, a... No, it is. What is it's, it? It's an accidental memoir, and it is being called creative nonfiction. And that is its category, creative nonfiction. All right. And within this piece, at one point in the, in the memoir, which is actually an accidental memoir, and so it's therefore sort of a collective memoir, we have an exclusive interview with Marilyn Monroe, and she is asked, what do you think of Los Angeles? And she answers, Los Angeles has a rancid gleam like spoiled lemons. It coats everything in a sort of bad childhood waxy veneer flashback. It smells of ash in August when oranges look like eyes above singed hibiscus. You're hungry. You want to eat them, but they taste like chalk and make you thirsty. The sun laminates you like photographs stuck between cellophane. People keep cemeteries in scrapbooks on their tables, little prisons they show to strangers. The images are leached and greasy. They could be anyone. You could buy them in a thrift store for a quarter and pretend they're your relatives. Los Angeles reminds me of children in foster homes at nightfall when they take their clothes off. Things with ropes and pieces of metal are done to them and added on garages with the freeway rushing in the background like a cheap soundtrack. It's in sync, but it has no meaning.